in this lesson we will understand the difference between artificial intelligence data science machine learning and deep learning we will also see how these are related to each other with that we will also understand that uh, how generative ai is related to these terms let's start so as i told you that i'll be discussing this first why because uh, our generative ai is also part of this ai ai is a superset as you can see in this venn diagram okay so it's a superset it includes your machine learning deep learning and data science but the ecosystem of data science also exceeds ai okay so what is ai ai means creating smart machines to mimic human behavior or we can say it refers to the simulation of human intelligence in machines that are basically programmed to think and learn like humans so you must have seen uh, ai in a lot of uh, domains these days because it can easily analyze uh, large amounts of data recognize patterns and make decisions okay it is uh, mostly used in healthcare finance uh, transportation and entertainment fields these days then comes your machine learning which is a subset of artificial intelligence that is ai machine learning is a subset of ai as i told before and it is used to build a model based on training data to make predictions so using machine learning you can build a model to make predictions let's say to predict the winner of this world cup okay it is it focuses on developing algorithms and statistical models that enables a computer to learn from and make predictions or decision based on data without being explicitly programmed to do so so its techniques include your supervised unsupervised semi supervised and reinforcement learning it is also used in various fields such as image and speech recognition nlp that is natural language processing okay forecasting medical diagnosis and others now comes your data science data science is the subset of ai to extract meaning and insights from data so i'll give an example let's say you went to instagram and you liked some car videos like mg kia honda okay tesla so what will happen you gave your data to instagram that i like such videos such instagram reels instagram channels instagram accounts so what will happen the next time you will open instagram the instagram will automatically pitch you with such reels such post let's say some discounts on cars so how these things happened all these things happened due to data science because it extract meaning and insights from the data now let's say a car company wants to approach some people who love cars so whenever they'll add a sponsored post or story on instagram they know that these number of people like car videos so the same thing will be pitched to them so what data science did they connected the client with the company okay so in this way both parties got benefited the client got that discount and the company sold their product so that's the value of data science we say data is the new oil because an unprocessed data is of no use similarly an oil is of no use if it is not processed properly therefore data is processed and meaningful insights are generated now comes your deep learning deep learning you can consider as as a subset of machine learning according to the venn diagram you can see it is a class of machine learning algorithms to solve complex problems it focuses on using artificial neural networks with multiple layers to model and understand complex patterns in data deep learning algorithms are inspired by the structure and function of the human brain specifically its uh, interconnected network of neurons so why we were discussing this 
बिकॉज जनरेटिव ए इज अ पार्ट ऑफ डीप लर्निंग